Okay, second attempt at this. I tried it already once with my phone, but it didn't work out too good. Too good. So anyway, what I, this is for Chad over at Adler Farms. Uh, my name is Tom Johnson. I live on 10 acres. Not very big, but as you can see, we got chickens. There's a couple pig sheds. Uh, they got the rails there to keep the sows from rolling over on the piglets. Uh, I think my dad paid 50 bucks for those. Oh, this was back in the mid 80s, late 80s. When I had sheep, I was in high school, had sheep and was in the FFA and all that. We've always had horses and cows up until about 10 years ago. But anyway, back to the rope. So you have uh, your piece of rope here, tie you a snap on the end of this, you know, like what you'd have for a dog leash or whatever. And you just tie that on there. Then you come up about however far you want for your uh, uh, noose around the, the cow there, your loop there, and you tie a uh, loop in right here. Let me set this tablet. I'm having to do this with a tablet. So let me set this down here. Whoop, drop this on down here. Okay, let's see if we can do it right here, about like so, maybe. So, recap here is let's see if you got it okay here is your deal you put a snap in here then you come down on your piece of rope however long you need and you just do one of them silly old knots like this you know bring it over bring it back through itself so you have a little loop here like so then once you catch a cow you have a your other end of rope to rope the cow or whatever and this would be the snap you just take and you snap it on here. Then you have your noose or your loop around the cow's neck. Then what you do is you take this end and you bring it back through here and bring it up over the cow's nose. And then you got yourself a halter. So it would be coming through here like this. Here's the cow's head and his nose is right here. And then there is the, the halter. So you can't choke your cow. And it puts enough tension on the cow's nose to make him do what you want him to do. So, sorry about the video quality and however and how it is. It's just uh, doing it by myself with my tablet. Um, anyway, uh, the rope there, that 70 foot of rope, got it at Harbor Freight. That'd be a little too long. You really don't want that dragging behind you. But you can, take and cut it up for $7. Get it up into 10, 15 foot pieces. Got you plenty of rope to do it. And you always need snaps on a farm. You can use those to keep your gates closed, put a chain around it, put a piece of rope around it, whatever you need to do. So, uh, yeah, that's about it for that one. Um, if you thought this might help you a little, if I explained it okay for you, uh, go ahead and hit the like button. If not, then uh, that's fine too. Uh, one of these days I'll make better videos. But anyway... You guys have a great day. Talk to you later.